hobbies that make me money and this is anodizing and in this particular occasion I'm using a mini anodizer which you can find almost anywhere just google it so if you've got little titanium parts or bolts or screws that you want to do for your car or motorbike you can do it with an anodizer or you can do it at home simply by using 9 volt batteries linked in series which I'll show you in a moment all you need is distilled water, some baking soda like I've just shown you, a plastic bowl or a jar, something like that, which is non-conductive, and a couple of leads with a piece of stainless steel. Even a steel teaspoon would do. And we begin by setting it all up. First of all, the piece of steel or the teaspoon needs to be clipped to the side of the tub or the glass jar in this case. And you'll need a couple of leads and some batteries and for the demonstration purposes, I'm going to use some titanium chopsticks. Making sure they're clean, you can do that with acetone or just give them a really good scrub in hot soapy water and dry them thoroughly. Or you can even use a piece of jewellery like I've just shown you there, a titanium ring. And you can then colour them to whatever colour you wish. Now there's a chart coming up in a moment which you can pause the video at and it will show you how many volts gives what colour. So here I'm just linking some batteries in series, that's how you do it. And then you've got a positive terminal and a negative terminal. The number of batteries determines the number of volts, determines the colour you'll get. So that's why it's much easier with a mini anodizer. At least this method allows you to try the experiment before deciding to buy a mini anodizer. The two coloured leads I've got are red and black, simply to make it easier to remember. The red goes on the positive, the black goes on the negative. And then the black goes to the stainless steel and the red goes to the object you want to anodize. And then immerse the object into the solution and you won't have to wait long and you'll get the color which is determined by the voltage i.e. the number of batteries. Six 9 volt batteries is going to give me a lovely shade of blue but you can get a whole spectrum of colors by having a mini anodizer. Take a look and see if you can find one. It's a great hobby 